morning. Guess who's in Japan? So I've just gotten off the plane from a 10 hour flight from Sydney and I've just arrived in Tokyo. My name is Sophia Fukunishi, I'm 27 years old and my father is Japanese and my mother is Australian. Growing up in Sydney, in my school, there wasn't any Japanese people and it kind of made me not like being half Japanese. At the time in primary school, a teacher of mine she saw I had a bento box and had some onigiri and stuff packed and I loved onigiri, I still do. She looked at me and was like, what is that food? What have you got? And I told her, she goes, you know, you shouldn't be eating that weird food. You're in Australia now. You should, you know, eat food like the other kids. I was devastated. Um, after that, I refused, refused to bring onigiri to school. Anything weird, no bento boxes anymore. When you're younger, you don't want to be different. You want to be like everybody else. And my friends were all blonde hair, blue eyed girls and all the boys wanted them and they didn't want the little half Japanese short girl because that wasn't cool back then. So as a teenager, I just really didn't like it. I wanted to be blonde. So I've decided to come to Japan now because I thought it was time to explore the Japanese part of me and just just live in Japan and see how it goes. Yeah, I'm just leaving behind really great lifestyle actually. I was really loving it there. Also, I'm very close with my family and it was really hard to leave them at the airport. It's worth leaving it because this is half of me. Like, I'm half Japanese and if I didn't do it, if I don't do it now, I'd hate to regret not ever doing it. It's just, it's important to me. So even though I am leaving stuff behind, the amount I'm gaining from this is way more. So that's why I'm here. Japan is home to 128 million inhabitants, with a small number of ethnic minorities and a foreign population of only 2%, Japan appears homogenous. However, there is a change happening from within. Over the last 30 years, the number of people from different cultures, nationalities, and ethnicities coming to Japan has dramatically increased. As a result, friendships are formed, some fall in love, and begin a family. Today, one in 49 babies are born to a family with one non-Japanese parent. A new generation of mixed Japanese is emerging. These are the stories about what it means to be half Japanese in Japan today.僕は矢野デビッド三崎、28歳。お父さんが日本人で、お母さんがアフリカのガーナ人。お兄さんと弟がいて、僕は真ん中。お父さんとお母さんの関係がそれから悪くなって、やっぱこう22、23年前だから、